This is a theme like big school supplies. There's nothing you can see. Everything seems to be very oversized and very big. Hi guys, I'm Rohan Chand. I'm an actor and I'm a UNICEF supporter. And I'm really excited today to be at a UNICEF headquarters. So they've given me this box. I don't know what's gonna be in it. I'm gonna guess it has something to do with education because that's probably the thing that matters to me most. I don't know, it seems really big. I was expecting something much smaller. You know, I don't know what's gonna be inside it. So let's take a look. Jeez, okay. Oh wow, that's so cool. Okay, you have an alphabet thing. It's very colorful, a lot of animals and everything, rhinos, giraffes, donkeys, parrots, oh that's so great. Oh cool, you have a map on the back as well. Map of the world. So we have styrofoam, some building blocks I, I think. Yeah, a lot of building blocks. That's so cool, yeah, they have a lot of colors in here and everything I guess is for younger grades and stuff. So I remember playing with uh, having free time and play time to play with the blocks and build castles and everything. <laughs> we got a big protractor. This is like, I think the biggest protractor I've ever seen. <laughs> I never knew what this is called, but um, yeah, I assume it's for drawing triangles and it's also a ruler. Um, a lot of colored co uh, crayons, many packs of crayons, I guess, all different colors and everything. Big ruler, is this, is the theme like big school supplies or something you can see? Everything seems to be very oversized and very big. Uh, is this a, uh, a compass or something? I, I think my teacher actually has one of these, a big, big version of one of these so she can teach on the board. So I assume this is for, for drawing on, on boards and stuff. Okay, we also have blackboards, I guess. Might, these might be for drawing on and writing on and stuff. You can get a lot of use out of these things, so. <laughs> oh wow, okay, this is heavy. So I would assume that it's chalk, a lot of, a lot of chalk. I'm not gonna open it, actually, you know what, I might open it. Oh wow, yeah, it is a lot of chalk, a lot of pieces of chalk. I guess these go with the uh, blackboards. Paper, I guess this is for more drawing and stuff and creative projects, a lot of colors and everything. I think these are dry erase markers. Um, more pencils, a lot of pencils actually. Pencil sharpeners, pack of 20, so it's cool. These are pencils and black pencils. I guess you have like safety, more safety scissors so that people don't get hurt, <laughs> kids don't get hurt and also you know, never run with scissors and everything. That was the thing that I was always taught. Um, you have a lot of geometry kits, I guess. You have protractors. They have a compass. Actually, I have, I have one of these. I remember I use that for school all the time now since I'm in geometry. This is an armband, I guess. Is it an armband? It looks kind of like an armband or something. Education is a right. Education est un droit. Droit. That's really cool. I guess that's for putting on people's arms and kind of, you know, spreading the word. Box of 100 pieces of chalk. That's a lot of chalk. I have erasers in here, a lot of erasers. You know, you always go through erasers much quicker than you would expect. Uh. Not really sure what this is. Oh, it's a jar of paint. Paint for chalkboard. I guess it's maybe to paint over if the chalkboard gets old or something. I'm not quite sure what this. Uh, it might just be for painting and stuff as well, just for create their creative side. This is just eight non-toxic crayons. Can't have kids eating toxic crayons, but you know, safety first. These are locks, I guess, for lockers and stuff of kids, you know, you need to keep their stuff safe or anything. So, oops, spilling stuff everywhere. A lot of um, uh, sharpeners, more erasers, I guess. I would assume it goes, it's probably, I don't know, it's like, it's almost like a care package, I would guess, for like, for schools and stuff, so that schools can get the supplies they need in order to teach children, and teach children, you know, who would, who don't have a school near them. Or it could be used to set up schools and set up new, new schools, I guess, and give kids an opportunity that they wouldn't have had otherwise. This whole box, um, I'm not sure. That seems like a starter, school starter box or something, but I'm, I'm not sure. I wasn't too far off. That's that's pretty good, actually. I, I like that. I like that. It's going to box. It really does seem to have everything that you need. You didn't guess what that big black thing is. It's actually a black. Oh, that's great. Oh, I didn't even see that. Oh, that's really cool. Oh, so that's the paint for the blackboard. Oh, that's what that's for. Okay. Literally a school in a box. I thought it was like all the school supplies, but it is literally like almost a, a miniature classroom. great though because that's a lot of kids I mean I know my classes are about like a 20 to 30 so I mean this is much bigger and a lot of supplies for kids I was gonna say yeah this thing's huge you can probably take a bit of a beating I mean that's really 
think fortunate because through my education and everything, I really get a different perspective on the world. So I think we really need to work to change that because I think every kid should have the opportunity to have the education and that they need to succeed in the world. That's, I think, a really great thing about this because you are dropping these things into places where kids won't have the opportunity and kind of starting up those opportunities and starting almost a, a, a new school, I guess. But I think that's really amazing. Through these uh, school in a boxes, kids are being able to kind of pick a path that they're going to be able to succeed in and bring themselves out of the situations that they've been thrust into. And I, I think that really inspires me.